Hey, thanks for coming up to restorative justice today. Would you like to sign this confidentiality agreement? It's uh, everything said in the circle stays in the circle except for physical harm to self or others or legal activity, including drugs. Thanks. Now uh, we'd like you to fill out the survey. Just this top half, sorry. Welcome to Restorative Justice, everyone. Thank you for attending. Say your name, grade, how you're feeling, and now I'll explain, explain the process. I'm Aaron, I'm a junior, and I'm doing pretty good. Now that we've introduced ourselves, we'll have a circle representative explain the talking piece and guidelines. Okay, um, you need to respect the talking piece and no side talking, so um, someone has a talking piece and they're talking, don't be talking as well. Um, speak from your heart, so say which, how you really feel. A circle representative will now lead us in the oath of confidentiality. Please stand and take the oath of confidentiality. The restore of justice circle is now in session. Please raise your right hand and say how you will feel great. The referral concern will not be shared with the group. All right, um, the referral is from Mrs. Schmidt. Um, she states that Aaron has been late to class and disruptive upon arrival when he does come in late to class. Mrs. Schmidt stated that she has talked to Aaron about this and that he was disrespectful um, in their conversation and about this. Um, she also states that Aaron has a great sense of humor and he works hard when he's in class and gets on task. He has good participation. Please tell us your side of the story. Well, I come into class late most days and she just, she doesn't like this, so she starts yelling at me and I don't, know, I don't like people yell at me, so I just yell back and it doesn't get me anywhere, but. Thank you. Now we'll ask a series of questions so that we can understand the situation and get to know you a little better. How are you feeling this morning? Pretty good. How do you feel about being up here this morning? Um, I don't know, it's a little different, but it's fine. What do you like doing out, um, what do you like doing out outside of school? Um, I like to play sports and hang out with my friends. What sports are you in? Uh, wrestling, football, and baseball. What are you hoping to do after high school? Uh, go to college, um, get a job. How do you feel about school? It's okay. Not the greatest thing, but it's all right. How's your relationship with the teacher? Uh, we get along pretty good, except for when I come late. She doesn't like that. And yeah, I don't like being yelled at, so. How do you think that affects your grade? Well, I don't know. She uh, probably doesn't like it when I talk back, so it's probably not helping. What grade do you think you have now? Uh, B. What do you feel is affected by your action? Um, probably B. Okay, now we'll go around and say who you feel is affected. Now that we have determined who is harmed, why don't we go around the circle and say a time where we have had a disagreement with the teacher or we didn't get along with her. Well, so we have identified that you, your practice, and, and your teacher have been affected by your actions. What are the two main things that you're doing? have a conversation with my teacher and ask her what she thinks I need to do. What's that conversation? Um, well, I could just apologize for... We have de developed a plan to, to, to really repair the harm that, that, that has caused. So now, um, you and 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 to an hour um, plan, plan, plan set up a time to meet up. 
All documents have been signed, all parties have agreed to the contract for repairing the harm and taking responsibility for your actions. This is your now and respondent have agreed to a call of time within the next 24 hours. The circle is now adjourned.